All right, guys, we got our, our key set up, and we're looking at the word froze. What pattern do you see there, Logan? Consonant, vowel, consonant, silent E, because we got that silent. Yeah, What's uh, what, what do we have there? Do we have a long or short O? Froze. Long O, yes. Very good. And I want you to put long or short above the O as you put the pattern in. You can scribble the pattern in too. And then we should highlight that one in red, shouldn't we? Oh, not blue, but of course red. Okay. All right. So how about the next one? What pattern does that have? Jason Wilson. Consonant, vowel, vowel, consonant. And what, what do you hear there? Cole. Long or short O? Long O, right? And so what color was that going to get? It's going to get blue. How about this pattern? Show. What pattern is show? Go ahead. CVC, uh-oh, remember W. What's W at the end of a word? W becomes a vowel at the end of a word. So what pattern would that actually be? W is, is a vowel. Consonant, vowel, vowel. So what is it, Keith? Look, up, look at it. Consonant, vowel, vowel. Very good. And show. Is that a long or short O? Remember, long, what is it? It is long. Long vowel sounds say their name, right? How about this one, though? Um, so what color should that get, actually? Light de blue, yes. Now, go ahead, carry on. Uh, long. What do we got there? Consonant. Right? Okay. And long. What, what vowel pattern is that? Long or short? Long. No, because that would be loam. Short. Ah, ah, ah. It's a short O because it follows that consonant vowel consonant pattern, and it's going to be a short O, yes. You guys understand your short? All right, go get after it.